Hey, welcome back, folks. Today's table is Jack's Open. We're going to try and hit 200,000. Do a little tutorial along the way. All right? Appreciate it, guys. Let's do it. Hey, Jack's Open. Here we go. This is one of the original 22 Gottlieb tables that came with the Legends Pinball system. And we're going to play and try and get a couple hundred grand. But before we do, let's talk about some specifics and do a little tutorial here. The table consists of card hands, as you see, starting at two jacks, three queens, full house, royal flush. And you complete the hands by knocking down the appropriate drop target. There's the roll drop targets in the middle. For instance, when two jacks is lit, you hit the two jack drop targets, you've completed that hand. You get 5,000 points for doing that. You get 1,000 points for every drop target you hit. Once you complete that, it'll go on to the next one, three queens. You complete that one, it goes to the next one, etc., etc. When you complete the royal flush at the top, that special will light. When the special is lit, only the red drop down targets will remain. And you knock those down and you get your 5,000. And the red ones will pop back up and you knock them down again. And it only stays on that until you lose your ball. Now there's some rollovers at the top too. You see there, there's four of them and they represent each of the suites, hearts, diamonds, spades, clubs. If you complete all four of those rollovers, knocking out the lights, turning out the lights, you will complete whatever hand you're on. It'll automatically jump to the next hand. When I first heard about that, I thought, oh, that was cool. That's kind of an alternate way to complete hands. However, this is even better. When you go through a rollover that's lit and you take down that light, that will increase uh, points you get on the drop down targets. So instead of being worth 1,000 points each, that drop down target is now worth 2,000 points. Best possible situation is to have three of those rollovers completed, increasing the drop down targets by 3,000 so that they're worth 4,000 points each. So instead of 1,000 points for every target you hit, you're getting 4,000, and it adds up quick when you start knocking down those targets and completing hands. Each of those rollovers also corresponds with some of these bonuses on the side alleys that lights these up. These are nice, but it's not as uh, profitable as knocking down the targets at 4,000 per. So anyway, that's what we're going to try and do. We're going to play as long as we can. Uh, first thing we're going to try and do is knock down a rollover or two. That'll increase the value of our drop targets as we talked about. Hey, there's two of them down right there. That makes our drop targets worth 3,000 points each. Okay, whew, let the break. Uh, they call this game Jack's Open, but they should have called it Middle's Open. Because you're going to lose down the middle almost every time. I lose the ball down the middle a ton, and it's extremely frustrating. But, you know, you deal with it. Recognizing when it's heading towards the middle and nudging is the key. And that's just not a skill set that I really have. That's probably the weakest area in my game. Okay, so let's get the other jack. Complete this hand. That'll be... Oh, jeez. Uh, that'll be worth five grand. Each hand you complete is five grand. There we go. You notice... I captured the ball, which is cool. You see me do that all the time in my videos, but I only do it when the ball's moving slow. You'll see the out lanes have a post and an opening. That's kind of cool when the ball's going down that out lane quick and you think you're gonna lose it, and then it hits the post and comes back in and you're like, hey, I saved the ball, cool. But it also works the other way. If the ball's coming down and you try and capture it, if it's moving pretty quick, it's likely to go right back up there and come down here and you lose it. So I only try and capture the ball when it's moving slow. All right, let's see if we can get some of these queens knocked down. One, up the middle. Hey, there we go, okay. Mmm, oh, there's that middle I was talking about. 46 grand on the first ball is pretty decent though. I can't complain, cannot complain. Oh, that was dirty. Bad hit by me though. There we go. This is not a game you can get cute with as far as flipper tricks and things like that or you know dead drops. I, and sometimes the ball's coming and it look at that right down the middle every flipping time when the ball's coming to a flipper I just want to hit it just hit it because 
Every time I try and do something too cute, I will lose it. Actually, all the red ones there, so let's just get those done. Let's go. Ooh, can I get the A on the backhand right here? No. Let's try that again. Can it be done? Hey, there we go. Alright, got my royal flush now. So the rest of the ball, this doesn't change. I'm just going to be hitting this over and over again, you know, with luck. It'd be nice if they were worth four grand each. Ooh, that was stupid of me. But right now they're only worth three grand each, and I'm at 114k on my fourth ball. Wanted to hit 200k? Yeah, shoot, right down the middle, of course, because I hit it up the middle. That was my fault. If I'd have hit it where I aimed, I wouldn't have done it. All right, let's see if we can get this one down the middle or over one of those middle rollovers yes okay so that gives me an extra grand per Whew, that was dirty I mean, not being able to capture the ball like I normally do is, is pretty tough for me and that's why my aim is off all right so we get that 10 there all right. interesting nugget about this table Woo! Uh, the slingshots the slingshots are not the normal kind of slingshots that will bling, 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 your ball you know off in the other direction real hard the slingshots don't have the powered returns so that you your bounces off the slingshots are not that bad ah oh, darn it well 179 grand I really wanted that 200 but at this point I'm probably gonna be happy with the 179 I'll take that Anyway, I hope you learned a little something, and I hope you give this game a try. Appreciate it, guys. We'll see you on the next video.